My mom was an athletic, tall, skinny, surfing mom who didn't act like normal moms. <laughs> she was better. Any minute now My ship is coming in I'll keep checking the horizon And I'll stand on the bow And feel the waves come crashing Come crashing down Down Of your heart, let the light shine in. Don't you understand? I already have a plan. I'm waiting for my real life to begin. The money from this cause will be going directly to brain tumor research and our beneficiary is going to be UCSF Brain Tumor Research Center where Christian was treated. The reason people should give um, is to you know, stop brain tumors. I mean, it's just, it's that simple. We are told that the money donated in Christian's name approaches uh, the largest amount given in a grassroots type of, of uh, movement. So we're really proud of that and uh, I know Christian would be too. Fill your heart, fill your heart and write those checks and know that we will save someone's child. So some people just touch you more than others and Christian was certainly one of those people. Uh, but she was a remarkable woman and I, I remember exactly the first time I met her and the day that she died. Uh, well, Christian, like some patients, you know, you just always remember them because they're unique. Um, every patient, every person has their own identity, but she, uh, I remember her as a very young, vivacious, free spirit. And uh, she had a great attitude, always, even in the thick of things, when things were not going well, I can remember her smile like it was yesterday. Our entire tumor program, we will treat approximately 1,200 new brain tumors a year in terms of surgery. And in the clinic, we'll see an additional 2,000 or 2,500 patients from all over the world who come to the Brain Tumor Center at UCSF. We, we knew um, much less about her tumor type when she was first diagnosed than we do now. And the reason is that we've, we've been able to take an, enough of, a, of an interest in the genomics and the biology and the molecular features of these tumors to, to create a story. And, and it's that story that drives new therapies. Well, with regard to where money goes uh, that is raised to support brain tumor research at UCSF, the good news is it goes all to research at UCSF for brain tumors. So we have a very unique scenario here. This is the biggest, meaning the largest, collection of basic scientists and clinicians in the world under one roof that concentrate on brain tumor research. So when somebody gives money to support brain tumor research, we get together and we look at where we need that money directed the most. And it's donations like this that make all the difference in the world. So the money goes purely to brain tumor research here at UCSF. You know, you have to realize that one out of three of every people in this country is going to get cancer at some point in their lifetime. It could be brain cancer. It could be melanoma. So you have to take it upon yourself to deal with it. Every dollar counts. No question about it. No question about it. 
you can't underestimate how powerful even five or ten dollars can be if you put it together and everybody contributes you make an impact the biggest tribute any friend or family member could give to someone who has been lost to this miserable disease is to not forget about it and it is to dedicate yourself to making an impact. It's almost like a crusade. They need to go out there, raise money, dedicate it to brain tumor research, and try to come up with the cure for this disease. We will get there, but we desperately need the help.